Hey, Blue Girls! Haven't said that in a while. Anyways, if you are new to my channel, my name is Jessica, and this is my channel, so welcome. Um, so, simple as this, you clicked on this video because you want to know how I lost 12 pounds in less than a month. I actually weighed myself today, and it's a total of 14 pounds in less than a month. I started this whole gen journey at 169, and I weighed myself today, and I am at 155, and that's crazy. I have not seen a number in the 150s for like a year. That's kind of crazy. This is my before and after. I have a couple pictures. Now, I am a duck, and I didn't take a lot of pictures how can i say with clothes on and i just don't think that it's i don't really want to be sharing that like on youtube so um this is like the main picture that i showed and i'm gonna just show you like you know just pictures that i did take throughout this journey um <clears throat> they're not really like before and afters because i just took them sporadically anyways let's get into it so <coughs> coronavirus <coughs> So I did this in seven different ways, not like seven steps, but in seven, seven things that I did different um, made me lose weight. Seven things that I did different helped me lose the 12, 14 pounds in less than a month. So I'm just going to dive into it because I'm sure you're like, oh my God, girl, what'd you do? So. I wrote them down because I wanted to make sure that I had everything and that I, I really thought about this. So the first step is intermittent, intermittent, intermediate, inter intermittent fasting. Please, I, I don't even know if I say it right, but basically this. I don't eat from, like I stop eating between 7 p.m. and 8 p.m. I don't give myself a set time because things happen. I have a kid and like sometimes by the time, you know, I make dinner or whatever. I usually have dinner around like five and then I'll eat like a snack or something between seven and eight, and then by 8 p.m., I do not eat. No matter if I ate dinner yet or not, if I just so happen to skip dinner that day, then I just skip dinner. Um, so yeah, I don't eat past eight, and then I don't eat until the next morning around nine or 10. So me starting to eat between nine and 10, whatever, it's a total of 13 hours that I'm not eating. Sometimes I do 14, but like I said, I try not to because I found like what works for me. Some people, it might be like a 12-12 window. You'll eat between like, you know, you'll have 12 hours to eat and then you eat for, you don't eat for 12 hours. Some people do an 8-16 uh, window where you only eat for 8 hours and you fast for 16. That doesn't work for me because like I said, I have low blood sugar and I'll like just drop in the day. But anyways, so find what works for you and work with it. Some days, listen, I felt like Spongebob with no water, but this is the tea, literally. This is the secret, I think, as to why I lost so much weight. It's this, hold on, this. It is called Inmit, Inmit Tea. Now, I am not sponsored by them, but hey, yo, hey, yo, Inmit, if you wanna sponsor this meme, my videos, I'll take it. Anyways, so it's an intermittent fasting support. So it helps with appetite control, fat burning, hydration, and it gives you energy. It doesn't give me energy, but I mean, shit, if it gives you energy, then good. So basically, you just do one scoop at night, looks like this. They only have one flavor, it's the Tropical Breeze. At first it tasted a little nasty to me, but now it's actually not nasty. Austin tried it last night and he said he actually liked it. I put it in like a little to-go cup container from Target. I throw some water, eight ounces of water. I throw some ice and then I put that in there and I mix it and I just drink it while I watch my show. And then it fills me up, I don't feel like I have to eat and it helps me burn a lot of fat while I sleep and while I fast. In the morning, right you know before i eat breakfast so i usually wake up between seven and eight an hour before i eat i do my nether scoop so i do two scoops within like 24 hours basically so yeah get this it's uh i believe it's like 50 dollars, and you get 28 servings now i know that might be a little much but you gotta invest in yourself you know what i'm saying like 50 dollars on this or 50 dollars uh, twice at a restaurant like you know $25 each time just invest in yourself you deserve it the second step thing that I changed 
is no binging. So it kind of goes in with the intermittent fasting, but what would happen was I would diet and then I would stick with it, but then I would be craving something. And then I wouldn't eat it for like a week, but then after a week, I would just go crazy. I stopped binging. Like I just stopped eating and eating and eating and eating. I changed my relationship with food. I viewed it as like nurturing my body, nourishing my body, eating good things to make myself feel healthy instead of just eating for taste, eating because I'm bored, eating because I like it, eating because I'm lonely. You know what I'm saying? So I just changed my relationship with food as in like I just stopped binging and stuff. And when I crave something, this is now going into the third step. When I crave something, I eat it. If I want chips and salsa, which I always do, I'm going to eat it. But what I do is I just portion control it. So this right here, this is Ella's cup, by the way. Um, these are from Ikea. It comes in like a pack of four or five. They're literally like $1.99, I think. Maybe a dollar. I don't even know. They have pastel colors too. I just they didn't have them at the time. Basically, whatever doesn't fit in this cup, I don't eat it. So if I want chips, I'll fill, I'll fill it to the brim, <laughs> to the brim. And I mean like, you know, or maybe not all the way up, but I'll, I'll fill it up and I just eat what's inside and then that's it. That's all I get. And I noticed that after eating this much, I'm not even hungry anymore. So instead of having the bag next to me and just eating out the bag, which I used to, because you know, I didn't care. Um, I just portion myself. I satisfy those cravings that I have and I don't binge eat anymore because I don't feel like I need to. My next step, getting good sleep. Getting good sleep. Getting good sleep. I was not getting good sleep. What I do now, usually right after I'm done with my tea, like I was telling you, between 9 and 9.30, I start drinking my tea. Um, sometimes it's later. I go to sleep after. Brush my teeth and go to sleep because the more you're up, well, in my mind, the more I'm up, the more I'm going to want to eat, one. And two, you need good rest to feel energized the next day to go work out and do stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to feel good. And another thing, but I've been doing this for a very long time, is meditation. Meditation, no, doesn't help you lose the weight, all right? That's not what's going to make you lose the weight. But it does help you clear your mind and you get to manifest things that you want you know like i'll meditate at night always at night i just put a meditation um music on i just clear my mind and i just think about positive thoughts that i want i encourage myself that tomorrow will be a good day at the gym i'm gonna enjoy it and tomorrow i'm gonna feed myself with great things and i envision myself in the body that i want you know what I'm saying? I envision myself looking in the mirror and really loving myself and just appreciating it. So I think meditation does help a lot, but to each his own. Now, another step is this. I want to thank Lauren Geraldo for this. If she ever sees this, my heart will die. But anyways, uh, the 12, 3, 30. So basically on the treadmill, you do 12 incline at three speed for whatever 30 minutes when i first started this holy it was hard like 15 <clears throat> sorry after 15 minutes i was dead i was like oh my god but i just kept going kept going and if you at least just get that workout in like she was saying you feel good you feel proud you get that cardio and it works out your glutes because you're at an incline and it you know it motivates you to do something now i'm actually doing 12 3.5 30 i'm going at a 3.5 speed because the, the three speed just isn't enough for me anymore um but yeah it's a great workout routine i'm so happy that she shared that um when i first saw it i was like eh, i was like a little hesitant to try it because i was like my ways are better no it's amazing it's amazing especially for people who don't really like working out you know what i'm saying like some people don't like working out and uh some days i just go and do my 12 3 30 and I leave because I have something to do or I'm just not in the mood, which is okay. And then some days, recently, these past like two weeks, after my 12 3 30, I'll do some light toning, my arms, my obliques, my back, my butt. I'm trying to lose six more pounds before I really focus on like toning and growing muscle and stuff like that. That's just my own goal. Y'all can say whatever you want. No, you should still be doing weights. I still do it. I just do it light. But I just want to lose six more pounds and then I'll feel really good about myself. I don't look at myself and see that like snatched figure yet 
because I'm not toning, but that's my own choice. That's my own choice. So I'm gonna get there and I'll probably make a video in another month showing my progress and stuff. Now I'm nowhere near a fitness trainer and if you wanna invest in a fitness trainer, I got you. His name is Bradley and he is fire. He does online, so he does in-home and online, but right now he's actually booked in-home. Um, so he does this online course, it's called True App, and what happens is you do a Zoom call with him for about 30 minutes, and you know, you talk about what you want to achieve, and he, you, you show him what you can do, what you can't do, yada yada, you tell him, if you have a gym, if you don't have a gym, by the way, if you don't have a gym, he'll um, recommend you really cheap Amazon products that you can use to work out with. And with what you want to achieve, he literally builds you a program, which is wild, like for your body. And I'm talking like he knows your body, like it's wild. He builds it from scratch, from himself. He tells you every day what to do weekly. And at the end of each week, he does a check-in on Zoom to see, you know, if you're liking it, how you're feeling, um, maybe if you're ready to improve, or not improve, sorry, like go up in weight or do something else. Maybe your physical ability went up. Now, mind you, I'm not really good with these terms, but you really need to check him out. I promise you he'll help you. And he actually said, um, if you want to try one week with him, he'll give it to you for free. Not only is he just like a really good trainer, but I'm talking like he has like credibility. He's been a tier three trainer at Equinox. Not no little LA fitness, Planet Fitness. I'm talking like Equinox. And now he's an independent trainer taking people online and stuff. So like he, he you know what I'm saying? Like he knows what he's doing. This is, he's certified. He's certified. So message him now. Don't lose your spot. It's really affordable. Like I said, invest in yourself. Buy yourself some tea. Invest in a personal trainer, get some pre-workout, get proteins, you know what I'm saying? Get things that'll motivate you to like work out and do better and stuff. And my last final step, which is the cheesiest thing ever, is to believe in yourself. Because there are some days where I did not want to do it. I didn't want to push myself. I didn't want to starve, not starve, but like I didn't want, I wanted to eat and I didn't want to go to the gym. But... I thought about like the outcome and I believed in myself and I said, you know what? Nah, I want this for myself. I really want this and appreciate every milestone. There are some days where you're going to fluctuate in weight. At least I do. And I went up. Sometimes I'd be up three pounds. And I'm like, what am I doing wrong? But you're not doing anything wrong. That's your body. Appreciate it. But my camera's going to die and that's really all I have for you. So buy this tea. Try the 12 330. Thank you to Lauren message Brad he can help you I promise you he got you it's one week free too so if you don't like it you don't like it believe in yourself drink your water get some sleep meditate portion control go to Ikea and just be the baddest you can you got this and I'm gonna check in with you guys in a month bye